All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to a Sneakers Insight video. In today's video, I'm doing this video to help out Adidas. You know, because I to know that they could potentially lose out on it was like seven hundred and something million dollars, and it was it was a lot because of this whole Kanye West situation. But um, no, nah, like it it really sucks to see Adidas go through some stuff like that. And I'm doing this video because I really want to help them out and kind of just you know give them some advice to. I mean, like the brand is already big. All you just need is like that same level of power that you guys had when you did have Kanye West sign. And yeah, it might not be you know one person that has that power, but not trying to reference his song like i i just realized what i had just did i'm like dang bruh i'm like all right anyways rewind you know you might not have somebody of that caliber okay there we go there, there's there's proper wording and stuff but anyways jokes aside but no like seriously you guys just need like either a group or you if you can find a person but no i recommend a group i recommend a group and i recommend doing something along the lines like uh rihanna and her brand um savage venti when you sit down and think about how many people are behind that brand promoting it like there's social media influencers that i follow where they will promote like some savage venti uh, like clothing, lingerie, whatever. But anyways, they promote that stuff. And I imagine that that, like, yeah, if, with how many followers that they have, that's bringing in a lot of, like, revenue to the Savage Vinci brand. That's what Adidas need to do. You guys got to start getting social media influencers. I mean, you guys got to start getting sneaker channels, uh, the freaking Instagram models, gamers. Do, do everything possible, whether it's from your guys' clothes or whether it's from your guys' shoes, socks, underwear glasses hats whatever the situation is but it's like no get so uh, social social media influencers i'm saying like bro you guys all right so let's just say you guys wanted to market off some hats send out some hats to some social media influencers and just you know just be all like oh yeah you know tell them that it helps you guys during when it's like during the rain months or it helps you guys during the sunny months whatever or you know let's say if it's uh you guys want to market off some hoodies be like oh yeah you know we got these uh durable hoodies where it's like it's good for like winter conditions um if you uh oh for bro freaking a hoodie where it got like unzippable sleeves and stuff where it's like you know you just take the sleeves off and in case if it's a little gets a little bit too hot and it's like bro it could be a, a full-blown workout hoodie i just gave y'all an idea right there all right but even if it's that, bro, I will literally be the spokesperson for your guys' pants. I'm wearing a pair of Adidas pants right now. It's the pants where it has, like, these cargo pockets, and it has these zippers on the side where it doubles as, like, two pockets. I, I Look, you ask anybody, I have always, always have hyped up Adidas pants. Anytime when somebody asks me, like, oh, wear a good pair of pants, always say Adidas. Because you guys, you're the only brand that I know with good, durable pants that has zip-up pockets, all right? No, that's one thing that I love. I remember, I still remember when I had bought the, uh, the Tyro 17s. Oh my god, like, I have fell in love with those pants. It was funny because I remember at my old job, they had, like, a very strict um clothing like policy thing whatever and stuff um dress code dress code there we go but um no like i always always wore my adidas pants because it was like i felt like it was good uh, versus wearing jeans or like the one um type of like like you know like gray sweatpants of that material like um cotton no you guys have like this polyester like feel and i'm like bro it, it's literally like because at my old job bro I would be running around doing all different things like left and right from carrying heavy stuff, doing just a bunch of different crap. Adidas, the uh, the Tyro 17s, I mean, just all Adidas pants that I've bought after that have always, always been comfortable. So if you guys need a spokesperson for your pants, like, bro, send me out whatever colorway possible. I will hype those pants up to the max. And then I have to say, like, no, one of my favorite pair of shoes in the recent years are the Adidas Top 10 because these shoes are mad comfortable, all right? and affordable and they just they and it's no well with these ones i don't know because i have like a pair of suede ones but i feel like with these ones and then they also have these patent leather ones where they um yeah they just come off as very very durable shoes like i feel like i can wear these shoes out in rain snow whatever the situations are and uh yeah it, it'll just overall be a dope shoe and things and so i'm like no i really do love the adidas top 10 like you cannot bring i made sure i bought me a few pair i got these pair i got a black and white pair 
and somewhere in my room, I also have like a green and black pair. I'm like, no, I, I like that's like my new favorite shoe in the recent years and stuff. Cause I'm like, I'm saying it really beats out paying like $200 for some shoes or even going on reselling websites. And if there's a pair of shoes I want to get where it's like, okay, like them shoes are going to be mad expensive. And I'm like, all right, can't afford them, but I do need me some shoes and stuff. I feel like I have a lot of shoes, but just, I don't have enough, all right, I don't have enough, but, no, but I'm saying, like, you know, with it, uh, with the Adidas Top 10, and then from, like, other shoes that I have of Adidas, where it's like the, and no, I think, I don't even remember if I had said that in the beginning of the video, because I've done numerous takes of this video, but no, the whole reason why I even got into sneakers in the first place is because of Adidas, so that's what I'm saying, bro, it's like, y'all need to have people, I mean, it could be me, like, if, I'm saying, if Adidas, if they contacted me, and they was all like, like, hey, we want you to be like a brand ambassador and stuff. I'm down. I'm 100% down. I'm like, I will literally, uh, you know, talk on the stuff that I already have. Or if you guys want me to go to the nearest Adidas store and then I'll like just pick up some things and, you know, just whatever. I'm like, I don't even care. Like, I will, bro. It. I don't care if it's like a hundred and something degrees outside or 20 something degrees outside whatever you guys or even if you just want to ship it to my house whatever the situation is i am down for it all right because no man it's like i i would really hate to see adidas like fall under i'm like i feel like you guys are such a good brand and i'm like hey it's yeah it's just it's one of those things where i'm like nah man it's like so i don't care if i gotta do it or if there's other social media influencers that gotta do it but it's like that's where you guys need to be at you know or if you want the brand to like go to exceeding amounts to where you're not losing you're gaining 700 and something million dollars this year yeah it's like y'all gotta start talking to the social media influencers i'm saying like talk to the makeup artists the gamers the you know vloggers the freaking whoever just any content creator social media influencer just anybody that's on social media you gotta contact them all right start from the biggest all the way to the smallest or if you want to reverse it start from the smallest people of content creating all the way to the biggest people of content creating just do what you guys got to do because i i don't want to see y'all fall under all right so but anyways and that being said i will talk to y'all later thank you guys for watching like subscribe if you are new to the channel and peace